what's good youtube it's your boy dr e fields and before we get into anything man make sure you like subscribe drop a comment down below say what's up say whatever you want to but hey today we got the triple og double og george carlin with people are boring so i mean some people are some people aren't it's just how it is but hey less talking more watching like always like always all my george carlin stands out there Let's get into it. Now, you wouldn't know it from some of the things I've said over the years, but I like people. <laughs> she. I do. I like people, but I like them in short bursts. I don't like people for extended periods of time. I'm all right with them for a little while, but once you get up past around minute, minute and a half. I gotta get the fuck out of there. It's weird. I think people need other people, though. You know what I'm saying? It's because I feel like if you're just by yourself all the time and alone every single day, like, I don't think that's a, a good way to live, right? Wouldn't it make sense? Hey. And my reason for this, my reason is for one that you may share, possibly, I have a very low tolerance level for stupid bullshit. That's all. Stupid bullshit. Yeah. yeah. That's true. Really and everyone wants to tell you their stupid bullshit. And a lot of them don't know when to stop talking. You ever run into that guy? Doesn't know when to stop talking. Just continues running at the mouth like verbal diarrhea. Don't know when the conversation's Thanks. over. Stupid, trivial shit you don't care anything about. Things you're not even remotely interested in. Did I tell you about my mom and dad? Well, my mom and dad went on vacation down to Mammoth Cave, Kentucky. This is about six years ago, I think. Seemed like it was six, about six years, years ago. Six or seven, possibly seven, could be. Yeah. Somewhere in there, six, seven, more than six, less than seven. <laughs> Let's call it six and a half. So my mom and dad went on vacation to Mammoth Cave, Kentucky, and my dad found a big rock. What he thought was a big rock, turns out it was a dinosaur turd. A petrified dinosaur turd, 27 pounder. You know, now that I think of it, it might have been eight years ago. I fucking hate people like that. Like, bro, if you don't just get straight to the story, and just tell me like all the highlights, all the climaxes, man. Because I don't want to hear you keep going back. He's like, wait, no, it was two months ago. No, 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 I think it was a year ago. Like, cut it out, cut it out. Just get straight to the point and hit me with it fast. Cause my attention span is like, un pequeño, a little. That would have been close to Y2K, wouldn't it? Remember <laughs> Y2K? Whatever happened? Everybody's all worried about that. Nothing ever happened. <laughs> Big fuss. Nothing ever happened. You know? God. That's strange, you know? So let's say, we'll say it's eight, eight years. Eight, it was either eight or five. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> So my dad gave my mom this big turd. He said, here, mom, this is a big dinosaur turd. Put it in your purse and take that home. <laughs> my mom said, dad, I don't think this is a dinosaur turd. This thing is still warm. Whoever dropped this thing is still walking around in here. And we better oh, get the fuck out of this cave. <laughs> nine years ago. Nine. I know it was oh nine my because my wife was pregnant with our first boy, Mahmoud Ibn El Saeed Ben Salam. And he's ten now. Or is he? He's 11. Maybe he's 11. He's either 11 or 5. And while all this is going on, you're searching through your mind for something diplomatic and tactful and graceful that you can say to help end the conversation. And all I can ever come up with is, blow it out your ass! 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 You can hate people like you know? that, man. But you can't say that. 
You, good manners don't permit it. You have to find another way, and I go to body language. I try to use my body language to show that the conversation's over. I find myself leaning at a 45 degree angle, <laughs> trying to indicate there. the direction I'd like to go, if this person would just shut the fuck up. I do that. I have I fold my arms and I'm like leaning. I'm like, mm -hmm. yeah, I got it. <laughs> Just gotta indicate. You and gotta I might go. even give him a verbal cue. Surgery, surgery. I'm late for surgery. I'm having my ears sewn shut. You know? Yeah. Same people on the phone. Same people on the phone. Don't know when to hang up. Don't know when the conversation's over. Dumb, trivial shit. Dumb questions. So what are you guys going to do five summers from now? We haven't made any plans. Marge wants to go to the beach. The kids kind of like it at the lake. And I want to go to the mountains. Grandma wants to visit her sister in Frog Balls, Arkansas. How about you? Have you made any plans? It's never too early to make plans. We're going to Norway in 2025. Did you know that up until the 1950s, Norway's economy was based largely on fishing? But now, thanks to the expansion of the world economy and increased, improved drilling tech, yeah, and it's once again, you're searching through your mind for the right thing to say to help end the conversation. Shut the fuck up comes to mind. Uh, or blow it out your, uh, how about uh, shut your fucking pie hole might be good. Or if he prefers cake, shut your fucking cake hole. But these things, you don't want to, you can't say those things. And, and you can't use body language on the phone. Well, mm -hmm. you can always amuse yourself, you know. Right. Or if it's your mother, you show your mother respect, you put her on speakerphone. <laughs> But that doesn't move the conversation oh, along. You have to find another trick. And I go to tone of voice. Do you ever use your tone of voice to try to talk them into a soft landing? You try to coax the person toward the end. Right. Good. Okay. Good. Mm. All right, then. Good. Right. Okay. Good. Okay. okay. All right. Oh, fuck. There he goes again. <laughs> I don't ever say bye, but like, yeah, okay. See you later. And you end it. You can't be saying bye, you gotta just be like, just gotta hurry up and click off, because people will go on forever. You remember my neighbor with the burns on 90% of her body? Well, she burned the other 10% now. <laughs> she was lighting a fart and her bush caught fire. <laughs> listen, li listen, Reverend. Re Reverend, Reverend, I, I hate to be rude, but I just took a three and a half hour shit. And I'm bleeding from the asshole. Well, I don't have any Mercurochrome. Yes, I, yeah, I'll put a Snoopy Band-Aid on it. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, thank you. You do that for me. Yes, say a prayer for my asshole. Thank you very much. You have to resort to these tactics because many people do not understand what a phone I'm call crying. should be or what a phone call is. <sighs> Ideally, a phone call is the brief exchange of a few vital pieces of information. This is a phone call. Hey, Steve, what time's the circle jerk start tonight? <laughs> 10 o'clock. Okay, listen, I'm going to be a little bit late. You'll have to start without me. <laughs> oh, don't worry, I'll catch up. I'm eating a whole bunch of oysters and watching a horny movie. Uh, it's called Tarzan Fucks a Zebra. <laughs> Russell Crowe. Well, it's kind of a fantasy. Right now, Renee Zellweger is blowing a unicorn. That's a phone call. It should not be a two and a half hour harangue of your third cousin describing her mailman's liposuction. God, people are fucking boring. People are just fucking boring. Oh shit. Oh, I was about to say that, but you can start it again. But yeah. <clears throat> gotta get, yeah, let people know. Like, oh yeah, man, that's nice, nice. Hey, I gotta go. 
Wait, I'm sorry. Something slipped up. I gotta go. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the video in the comments down below. Say what's up. Say whatever you want to. Say what's on your mind. Got a cracker. Might have to eat it after. But yeah, man. George Carlin, Triple OG. <sighs> Fucking hilarious, bro. Hilarious. Always kept it how it is. Gave it to you straight up. OG, man. But hey, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. And, um, have a great day. Peace.